Dr. Thomas Magnani, Dental School, Class of 80. I always wanted to be a dentist since I was about age five. So I chose to go to Columbia. Our first two years were part of the medical school. And then our last two years, we went into the, the dental school and learned our dental education. So we're very medically based, and it's one of the only schools in the country that is. I consider myself basically a physician of the mouth. My patients consider me that also. We had a, a group of us that would go to the Tom and Sells, which was a bar on the other side of Broadway. You gotta remember in 1976, going across Broadway on 168th Street might have been detrimental to your health. And we'd go to the bar and nobody ever bothered us. I graduated in 1980 and I was put on the prosthetic staff at the dental school. I got a job with, a, with an instruct, with a, a, a professor that I was, who was teaching me at the time when I became mem uh, head of 1852 Society. Margot Jaffe was the president of the Alumni Association and Margot and I got together and said, we have to have events. We worked with the CAA and with our Alumni Association. There's much more camaraderie between the students and the faculty today than there was, was when I was there. I love the admissions committee, I'm still on it now. And our new clinic is incredible. It is a center for precision medicine. 1980 is the greatest class that ever graduated from Columbia College of Dental Medicine. The only class that comes close, of course, is my daughter's class, the class of 2017. And I became the class father of the class of 2017. They come to my house in Greenwich and I make meatballs and spaghetti sauce and we sit out there and we have a party. Mr. President, the faculty tells me that they cannot keep them under the thumb any longer. It's humbling because so many people have to really help you to get that award and I think that's the greatest achievement.